a little 35, 40 minute explanation of EXP, which has rapidly changed since the last time I did one of these and had the honor of co-hosting with a friend of mine, Rich Tomasini. Today, I'm an arguably better company with the <laughs> icon, Robin Mann. Robin, can you just give us a quick introduction about you and a little about your story here with EXP? Good morning. Hi. I'm so happy y'all are here. Hi, I see Keely. I feel like the romper room lady. I see Keely. Um, Oh, look, I've got to push record. Oh, we, she already did it for me. The key is on her game. Um, so I've been with EXP uh, almost a year and a half. Uh, I've been in the business for six years in my seventh year. Uh, I iconed last year on the route to icon this year. We'll talk about what that is later. Uh, I do about 20 million a year for the last few years. My goal um, has always been, well, has been for the last four years to do at least one closing a week uh, on average. And I've been able to do that the last four years. So um, EXP, I got here with Keely and man, it's good stuff. I can't wait to tell you all, all about it. Awesome, Robin. Thank you. I'm here in the center of the American universe in North Carolina, in Davidson, North Carolina, home to Stephen Curry and the exceptional brand. And I have been here, Robin, believe it or not, for almost double, almost three years here at EXP. When I came here as um, a lack of confidence agent, a newer agent, and I came to the industry with one idea, which was to change it as the most ignorant person in the world. Fortunately, <laughs> after years on, I'm very blessed and humbled to say I am getting there. But we just wanted to Get through EXP, you hear a lot of chat about the fastest growing and actually now the largest independent brokerage here in America. So we just want to stick to the facts and the figures, the numbers. Um, you know, I know we all speak a lot, or in my case, I can speak very ignorantly about what I haven't done. When I started explaining EXP two years ago, I was new to the process and I saw the value, I saw the opportunity, but I was in a very different place now three years from when I've seen the genuine benefit. And the only things I personally want to speak about are my experience. So let's get rocking and rolling. We know that the real estate industry is the best in the world, in my opinion. And we're very fortunate here in America where our commissions are sky high, average of 3%, unless you're selling with Ryan Holmes and it's a slightly different story, but we're very, very fortunate for where we are. Typically speaking, our industry gives us one opportunity to make a lot of money and to make a lot of money very quickly. We call that Lane one here at EXP, right? We are, and I'll give you a practical experience. When I joined EXP, I don't know if you can see this, I'm not looking at my screen, but I was like every other agent. My business card looked like that. It's about the company and my picture was there. Now my picture should be on it, but my business cards look like this. What we need to understand, in my opinion, about this industry is it is about us. The company we partner with can leverage us and can give us that confidence, so they gave me to the confidence, now it's about us. When you know this industry is about you and you're responsible for your success or ultimately your failure, you are going to go places. And EXP gives you all the tools, the confidence, the autonomy and everything in between to get to know that it is about you and really is the wing beneath your wings to get you to fly. We have all the uh, tools and systems you need from a sales capability. We're going to get into all of this in more detail. We've got Skyslope, your transaction management system. If you want to see something that's absolutely mind-blowing, we have a virtual world. So we know through COVID, the last year has been, in everybody in the world, has been one of the most bizarre and intriguing years of our life. Uh, fortunately, I don't know if we're coming to the end of it or if we're close to not the norm of how things used to be, but the new normal, if you will. We have not shut down as a company because we have a virtual office which you can log into, get your questions answered, get your training, get your collaboration from anywhere in the world. We have KV Core for our CRM lead generation. We have an iBuy program. Something I signed up for in January is our healthcare, which I never had before. And I compared it to the National Association of Realtors. Me and my young family, well, old me and my young family, are saving a ton of money with better healthcare as of January. So we're going to touch upon all of this, which is uh, lane one. We call it a super highway which reminds me of being in Selling Sunset in LA, because we have two other opportunities, two other lanes here at EXP, which are not readily, freely, and openly available really with any other company here in the US, or even quite frankly, globally. The opportunity we love, um, it's the human psychology of us. We love free dinners, we love free lunches, we love the opportunity of being recognized, we love awards. Miss Robin Mann has a trophy of awards, being an icon agent, which we'll explain what that is soon. How about the opportunity as someone with a four-month-old and a four-year-old to acquire additional wealth, acquire shares and stock in a publicly traded company, as you can see on the NASDAQ, which is the American Technology Stock Exchange. Well, I get shares of stock in my company, and I have acquired a lot from having a four-month-old and a four-year-old, by which they can probably go to a decent college if they are smart, 
and they don't want to get into the family business. And then lane three, something which I did not join EXP for in all complete honesty and transparency. However, at this moment in my career, it's changing my life and changing the life of many others, which we're going to touch on later. Real estate, quite frankly, and I've learned, Robin, you can tell me if I'm wrong, real estate is a pyramid, quite frankly. The franchise model is something where you own a franchise and that pyramid, the wealth goes to the franchise owner. And the larger companies, you have a franchise owner, you have a regional director, you have an office manager, you have a broker in charge. And then all the way at the bottom is you and I, the agent, right? The licensed agent, yep. me yep. here in North Carolina, Robin Man, licensed in South Carolina, and you wherever you are. Well, EXP has really changed what a pyramid is. We're removing the pyramid. We're removing the franchise owners, the regional owners, the brokers in charge. All those hoops you needed to go to create your own team, create your own revenue share, as we call it here at EXP, your own element of growth has been removed. You do not only need to be licensed in your state to sell real estate. You can partner up with anybody in the US, anybody in Canada, and many countries around the world to create your own global real estate team. And this is something that is changing many lives. Again, less than 1% of people here at EXP focus on this. And it's not something I joined for, but at this moment in time, it's changing my life and I want to touch upon it. So the super highway, the most American phrase we can come up with, which I absolutely love. One thing we've got to speak about, real estate, I'll speak ignorantly because I'm biased and I will say it for the second time. I do think it's the best industry in the world. Um, side comment, if we're going to have a Q&A at the end. We also have a chat box down here. So if you've got any questions, any thoughts, keep them clean and uh, put them in the chat box and we'll get to them. And we'll also have a Q&A at the end. Your honest thoughts, feedback is greatly appreciated. Good, bad or indifferent, we're going to take it because Robert and I are at an age now where we are good with it. So innovation is always happening in life. Innovation has never really happened in real estate. How do we know innovation? Because when I was a kid in the streets of London, every Friday, I would walk, remember, we could walk there uh, to Blockbuster Video. We would get um, whatever, it was a video, a VHS, if you will, uh, every Friday. Now, I ignorantly switched off the news in March of last year, ever since, ever since COVID came into play, and... I don't know what's going on in the world. However, I do know that because of my wife, not me, we do watch Selling Sunset. How do I know? Because it's, I couldn't tell you what time it's on. I couldn't tell you what's on the TV guide. But I know at 8 p.m. when we've got all of our kids to bed, we go to Netflix, we press play, and it's there. It's our convenience. We are living in a life of convenience, full accessibility. And how do I know that? Because if you want to go on holiday, actually, if you're a listing agent and you want to get a brand new listing, Go on to Airbnb or, or schedule your holiday online, not through that travel agent. Book something right now. Go to aa.com, book your flight, and I can guarantee you'll have a listing appointment come on the day one of your holiday. And as a real estate agent, you won't be switching this off anytime soon as well. This is our office. This is fully on. Until you throw it out the window, which I know we would love to do, we are fully engaged. And this never used to be the case. If someone wanted to sell their home before I was an agent, before I moved to America, they, every Friday, you would get that listing book and you would have to literally flip through the book and see the listing. You would have to go to that office to pick up the book and come back. Now, you literally look on your phone, you go on to Zillow, as much as most hate them, and you can put an offering on a house there and then. The innovation is happening in our industry, outside of the traditional real estate brokerages and who we all hang our license with. It's happening in our everyday lives. If we want to find out any information in the world, this device here is more powerful than what sent mankind to the moon, which blows my mind. So everything we need in our entire business is right here, yet real estate has always been that franchise model. You have to pay a desk fee, you have to pay a royalty fee, pay a franchise fee, go to an office by which most of them in 2020 were shut down because of COVID. Well, EXP thought way ahead of their time, if I may add, back in 2009 that, listen, innovation is clearly happening around us. A few years ago, social media came onto the scene. In 2006, Facebook, well, that's never gonna work. I was at university at the time, and I had to use log in with my university credentials. Now, the majority of the world is on Facebook, and that's where most people get their news, most people get their interaction. Innovation is always happening, and it finally, finally took a company like EXP to come along and bring that innovation into our space and our industry, one that, is, in my opinion, has always been needed. This is the difference between a brokerage and a franchise. I can't say I'm anti-franchise. However, I am not the biggest fan here in our space in the property industry. And in fairness, they're not the biggest fan of me either. Why is that? Because of limitations. So what's the difference between a brokerage and what's the difference between a franchise? You're going to see in a moment our cloud campus environment, our office space, our EXP world. 
Me, as just a single agent here in Davidson, North Carolina, I have my own building within EXP World. Yes, they don't need to come here with a fancy setup, but you log into EXP World, you put in my password, we have a boardroom, we have a meeting room, we have 18 offices, and each of us can collaborate from anywhere in the world. If I'm here in Davidson, if I'm in Mexico, if I'm on a beach, if I'm in London, I am in that office space from particular hours to meet anybody. It doesn't matter where in the world we are. Why is that important? Because we get to collaborate real time. The avatars, as you see in a minute, look a little bit crazy, very crazy. It'll take a five minute turnaround time and curve to understand. Why is it important as an agent? Because we have real time support. God bless all the brokers and charges in our industry. I would never want to be one, but I have so much respect for them. Realistically, at most franchises, to make any good money, they're going to have to be selling too. So they're going to be your competing brokers in charges. And their level of support, if you have 50, 100 agents in our market, which is as good as I've ever known since I've been in the industry, since I've even been in the country since 2010, you have questions all the time from newer agents, seasoned agents. We have real-time support. Let's trip away the fact that one broker in charge is responsible for everybody. Here in North Carolina, here in our market, Charlotte, North Carolina, we have a thousand EXP agents, one of the, the largest EXP uh, markets in the country. We have six or seven brokers in charges throughout the state of North Carolina, and we have real-time support. Not only can we give them a call, but we can get on into the world and ask any question we need. We have contract compliance support. If I need to go to the accounting department for EXP Realty, I can go on there, there into the world and get instant support. I'll be honest with you, if I need to speak to Glenn Stanford and we have a meeting, who's the founder of this company, I literally go into EXP main office, I schedule a meeting with him, I walk into his office. And again, we all have 24 hours in the day, nobody's special, but this is the most humble billionaire that created this change of our industry. And we will have a one-on-one -on -one meeting, 30 minutes in his office. That's what we can do here at EXP. We have real-time support from the top of the company all the way to the people who are helping you and I in contract compliance and in between. Scalability is something we'll touch upon in a moment. Like I mentioned before, the ability to scale your team, your virtual organization anywhere in the world is something that's never been available before. Let's talk about live training as well. We're going to get upon, and I'm going to rely upon the wonderful Robin Mann to touch upon all these points in much greater detail. This is just an overall view of what we offer here at the brokerage and the company. But live training, over 60 hours of live training every single week, not taught by people like me, like me who sell you know, 15, 20 homes a year, Taught by people like Robin Mann, who is an icon agent. That's the third time you've mentioned the word icon, and we'll get to what that means soon. But it is the top, what, 2% of agents here at the 52,000 agent company who sell more homes than the majority of us on the call. They specialize in a particular area. They teach the live training in the world for free in that particular area. You know, I remember when I was a brand new agent, I didn't know any better. And I joined Keller Williams for their training and their, the fact that they were an international company. And you know what? It was great. I had a great time there. And I'm very thankful for the relationships and my experience of learning about what a true franchise is. But who I was getting taught by as a brand new agent, in large part, I was selling as many homes from. So I'd much rather learn how to sell more homes with someone like Robin, who sells three, four times more than me. International collaboration is uh, my unofficial name here at EXP. And I'm going to touch upon that in a minute. Teamwork is just something that it's all about. There's a massive difference um, from someone who's rented a home before who now owns homes. There's a big difference between when you rent your home and when you own your home. So equity and teamwork come together. When you own your company, which we call here at EXP, we are shareholders of this company, you'll just see that creates a bond and teamwork like you can't fabricate at a company where if you leave tomorrow, quite frankly, you're very, very replaceable. International footprint. When I joined this company almost three years ago now, um, they were growing rapidly. I mean, not only here in North Carolina, but across the US. We're in most states, we're entering. And we had a good presence in Canada. Now, three years on, I was very humbled. Little old me, uh, one agent with no contacts around the world. Well, I was the, the first agent here at EXP to expand EXP internationally. I was very humbled to do my research, get my connections, and expand EXP to the UK. The first two countries we ever expanded to were the UK and Australia. Now, look at this. This is fascinating. We have grown as a company, as an organization into India, Hong Kong, Italy, France, everywhere you see on the screen. As of this week, Colombia, very soon, Israel and Spain. And let me tell you, it is exciting. Why is it exciting? You know, many of us have worked for companies like Keller, uh, Remax, Sotheby's and other companies like that. 
where you know they are a global company and my question is when i used to work with them i wanted to open up you know uh, keller williams in the uk and it just wasn't going to happen there were too many hoops and rules and restrictions regulations to go through but why did i really care i was a local agent which i still am here in my market so why do i care if this company is internationally well listen when you're a shareholder and you own that tangibility of ownership albeit a small piece of ownership in a publicly traded company that's why you care. Not only do we own Babella, the virtual campus, which has exploded through COVID for obvious reasons, but when we expand and embark upon every single country in our growth, that is of excitement to me, the shareholder. Not just me, the real estate agent, but me, the shareholder. We can touch upon this in the Q&A afterwards. I'm happy to be an open book of how we did it and, and what that looks like for me and what that looks like for us as a company. Before I hand off to the wonderful Robin, this is our world so when we do the uk webinars uh, twice a month we, we literally show you what it looks like we walk around we'll go into the main office and we'll show you we may not have time today which is fine we, we have videos recorded and we can show you privately the cool thing about this being a publicly traded company we have to be fully transparent you're seeing our numbers the cost the commission split absolutely nothing is hidden neither is our world if you want to come in for training I mean, somehow it's May, Robin, I don't know if you can believe it, but it's the 5th of May, happy Cinco de Mayo, yeah. and you can get access for the entire month of May to our EXP world. If you just want to come in and get free training 60 hours a week, we can send you a guest pass. Whoever got you on this call, get back to them. They'll be happy to give you a guest pass and show you around. But what it looks like is this. So that lady there in orange, she is an avatar. You know what? She could be me. I don't think she is because I'm wearing a British hat and I'm wearing a, a nice blue suit. But you create your avatar. We got about a couple of minutes in the bottom left hand corner there you have a microphone you speak audibly much like we do on the telephone avatar to avatar and they could be anywhere in what 17 countries currently actually more countries as we are having our guest partners come in and visit your instant support your ability to collaborate to learn to get your questions answered is right here if you have an issue with your laptop which one of my uh, partners did the other day we went into exp world together we went to the technology department Back in the day, we'd have to go to Best Buy Geek Squad where they actually remotely got onto their laptop, fixed the audio issue, and away we went. We had to schedule a meeting with a broker in charge here in North Carolina. We did the exact same thing. Tomorrow, I've got a, a scheduled meeting with a broker in charge in Texas with one of my partners. But guess what? I don't need to get on my plane. I don't even need to pick up my phone. I just need to log on, go into the world, and here we are. All the questions answered, all the training from anywhere in the world. If I'm on a beach, you would never know. If I'm here at my fancy office, you would never know. If I'm in my bed with a cup of coffee, you would never know. That's a little bit about our world. Now, getting into the details, the facts, the figures from someone that sells a lot more homes than me in all transparency and honesty. Robin, can you take it away, please? Yes, thank you. You did a fantastic job. Thank you for um, laying some foundation there. And I can listen to you talk all day, right? Right, guys? Um, okay, so EXP, we are the information is uh, phenomenally overwhelming. So one of the first things you'll get when you when you join EXP is access to enterprise. On enterprise, this is kind of your dashboard to your business. There's lots of different things on here and we're gonna go through a bunch of them together. Um, there's news, there's our preferred partners. We do have a, we don't talk about this a lot, but we do have a charitable organization uh, that goes out and helps others. So this is your dashboard where you're gonna go to for a lot of information. The world, like Barry mentioned, we'll talk about that. That's another place, but let's delve here into um, what's on enterprise. So these are the systems that drive your business. Um, Skyslope is kind of your transaction management thing. The great deal about Skyslope as you go in, uh, you put in your documents and they, they do this little beautiful uh, list. I'm not a list person. I'm, I'm a high D, but uh, if you give me a list to do, I'll do it. So uh, they give you the list. You, you upload your documents to the list and that goes to compliance. Compliance looks through your list and they'll say, no, you missed a signature here or uh, you need to have this form filled out. Now, the cool deal about EXP is if you actually do your checklist and have your form submitted, you get paid at closing, like boom, you, before you even get home, there could be a check in your mailbox or in your uh, bank account uh, or not in your mailbox, in your bank account. So um, it's a beautiful system, this sky slope. It helps you manage things. You can also could go on there and see how close you are to capping. Um, it lets you just kind of track your progress, which is an important thing in this business. If you don't do that, that's going to help you go to the next level if you track your business. Um, we do use DigiSign. We do use zip forms in there. And uh, it's, a, it's a beautiful thing, the, uh, the sky slope. Now, KV Core, 
KV Core rocks my world, like rocks my world. Used to be called Conversion. This cost, I believe, somewhere from six to $800 a month if you're not with EXP, if you're with some other not not us cool brokerage um, and you want to buy this on your own, you're looking at six to $800 a month. This um, is part of your $85 a month that we'll talk about later uh, that goes into your fees for, for uh, EXP. What KV Core is, it's multifaceted. Uh, it has, um, and I think, nope, we'll keep going back there. The uh, KV Core, so you can personalize it to your clients. You can use this instead of MLS to send listings uh, to really hone in on what your people want. They can go on there and the, so there's a little heart icon on there. They can go on there and heart things and leave you notes. Uh, the piece that I love most about KV Core and this, um, so I said I do about 20 million a year. I believe a lot of my business is uh, happening because of follow-up. And what this does is what I was doing manually uh, for about four years uh, when I was at, K at KW. Um, what KV Core is, it's, it's technology that works, <laughs> which makes me laugh because uh, there are companies that like to present themselves as tech agencies and we are like we are our technology works i was on beta teams and um leadership teams for other companies for their technology and they presented it really well like it was going to be phenomenal and it wasn't it was always dud so this here works kv core what you can do, go in there and do um so let's say that barry was my client i talked to him today he tells me this is what he wants in a house. I can set up a search for him, like I just said, or let's say that he wants to sell his house, but it's gonna be a month and he wants a contractor. So I can write notes in there. I can set him up on a drip campaign and you can personalize your drip campaigns. And then this is the cool part. If you utilize the system, there's a task you can set in there. So if I open up my computer today, or if I, if I set it up for my phone, I'll get a little ding on my phone that says, call Barry, send him a contractor. Um, or call Barry, follow up on, is he ready to list his house? So it allows you to stay in touch with your people in an organized fashion, and it's very user-friendly. I don't even begin to tap the uh, resources with KV Core, but I will say I have received leads uh, with KV Core. And that's, I never received a lead ever before uh, at any other agency. So if you will just put, you know, put your toes in there, um, KV Core is, is a phenomenal resource. Workplace. Okay. Workplace is so crazy cool. So Facebook has partnered with EXP and we have our own, we're the largest platform, uh, work platform on Facebook. And so if you look there, it, it looks just like a, a Facebook screen and there are groups all over the world and groups for all different settings. There's like a, um, there's like a pride group. There's a, a, a black group. There's a women's group. There's a men's group. There's um, newbies, there's uh, veterans, there's people who want to know about um, referrals. Referrals are huge on workplace. You can put into your referral group, I need somebody in Kalamazoo, Michigan, and the Kalamazoo, Michigan people will pop up and um, and, and take your referral. <laughs> I know people within EXP have used workplace. They, they're on it like, like, like white on rice and they um, that's their whole business is getting referrals from one another. Great place for networking. You can go on there on a daily basis and learn. There's so much information. Like I try to go on at least once a day and scroll through every single day, every single day, without a doubt, I learned something just by popping on to workplace. Uh, it's, you can set up um, groups that are uh, based on your state, you can go in there and talk to your brokers. There's just so much. It's overwhelmingly phenomenal information. And again, it's user friendly. It's in one spot. And uh, it's one of my favorite things about eXp. Now, eXp marketing. This one will blow your socks off. So I was in the world one day uh, with my cute little avatar. She has my hair and she's wearing, she's wearing black and some cool glasses now. I do wish they changed the women's shirts, but you know, hey. Um, so uh, I went into the world and they said there was a class on marketing, um, on, mar on, on using EXP's marketing. So I went in there and did the class. And now this circles back to KV Core and to EXP marketing uh, all combined together. This is where they married. It was very nice. This guy did a class, it was a 20 minute class where he taught us how to create a postcard on the spot that was one neighborhood and it even narrowed down to um, people who had owned their homes more than three years. 
and you could send them a postcard. So like it went from, you know, this massive potential mailing with hundreds of thousands of people down to the neighborhood where people had sold, had, had bought more than three years ago and boom, you've got like a very fertile garden of, um, of leads to touch. So um, that was one way I saw it utilized. He, that guy on that uh, class too, he actually created a postcard for somebody in the class and sent it out for them. It was like pennies to do the, uh, to do the mailing. So that was, that's exciting. But in here also, let's say you're not tech savvy. A lot of people get freaked out about, oh, I'm not a tech person. I don't want EXP. Uh, I, I want real people and I want connections. We have all of that. But the cool thing about this piece, again, user-friendly, you pop your picture in there, you alter the text a little bit if you want. There's listing uh, packets, there's buyer packets, there's open door flyers, there's um, open house, I'm sorry, open door flyers, not open door, open house flyers. Um, there's everything you can need for marketing. You want to go buy some EXP swag? It's there. So just myriads of information uh, are available to you on the marketing center. All right, let's see where we are. Oh, the big, the, this is where you really, this is the one that oh, caught everybody's attention right here. All right, so you've heard some great stuff. We're tech-based. We've got great stuff, uh, great, great um, resources. And um we're, we're a great culture. I do. We haven't talked on culture, but we'll talk on that. So what do we do in terms of money? Um, we are no desk fees, no royalty fees, and no franchise fees. It's a beautiful thing. I talk with people and I'm like, you, you pay what? Wow. So here's a scoop on us. We're an 80-20 commission split. That's everyone from the person who walks in the door today to me. We're an 80-20 split and people above me. That was one reason I joined EXP. There were people that I could aspire to be. Um, and I didn't feel that in my other company. So um, we are an 80-20 split for everyone, no matter what. That's what you pay. But you have a cap. Our cap is $16,000. Meaning, and if you don't know what a cap is, well, you, you've picked the right place because our setup is phenomenal. A cap is you have paid in X number of dollars to uh, your company. So with EXP, let's say you get a $10,000 check. Okay. You're going to get, you're going to get 8,000. EXP is going to get 20. Uh, they're going to, you're going to get, they're going to get 2,000. So 8,000, 2,000. Once you've done that uh, enough times where you've paid 16,000 to EXP, then you get a hundred percent commission for the rest of the year. So my cap is January. Um, I pay my 16,000 and then as soon as I cap, so this year I capped in April. Um, I took some time off in, in November, December and I capped in April, which is still phenomenal, but I get the rest of the year at 100%. Now there is a capped transaction fee. So once you hit cap, you're gonna pay 250 a transaction until you hit 5,000. And once it hits 5,000, it's reduced to $75. I think we have over 600 employees uh, that are EXP folks and we gotta pay them still somehow. So you pay the 250, once you've hit 5,000, then you're reduced to 75. Now, here's the cool piece on this. We've talked about it briefly. Once you've done that so many times, uh, once you've hit that 5,000 and then you've done, I think it's 20 more deals, and there's a dollar number to it as well. You can hit what's called icon. Um, icon, I got to icon last year. I, I'll icon this year. There have pe been people who've iconed twice in one calendar year. Once you icon, you get your money back. That's $16,000 that I paid in. I get it back in stock. So we'll talk about that more in a minute. Standard cost to join us today. You one time only fee, <laughs> uh, 149. So you'll pay a startup fee of 149 or $85 a month. For that $85 a month, um, you get KV Core, you get your world, you get uh, your email. For that 149 startup fee, you get a thousand business cards, you get folders that say EXP, they're very pretty. Uh, I think they give you a button still, like a little EXP button, metal button. So, um, so 149 startup fee, 85 a month for your cloud brokerage fee. That's where they're like, monitoring their that uh kb core where they're looking at stuff that's part of the money that's paying for that your website that's part of the money that's paying for that we don't have a huge overhead we still have some people to pay and 85 dollars a month is a deal for what you're getting uh, a 25 dollar broker review and then a 40 dollar risk management eno the eno uh caps out 
at $500. So once you've paid 500, that drops off. And then the broker review is per transaction. So um, you'll see that, uh, you'll see that come out of your check. Okay. If anybody has questions on any of that, we can hit that in a little bit. Okay, so this is where we get to talk about something that I had absolutely no interest in when I came to EXP. <laughs> I was like, I don't know about stocks. I'm not a stock person. It means nothing to me. Well, when my stock hit 100, oh, not allowed to say, when my stock hit high dollars last year, uh, I started liking stock and having some interest in it. So the, the deal with stock, I don't know of another company that does this. Uh, and so now it is very attractive to me because I've seen the power in it. I've seen colleagues in our group that are buying beach houses because of their stock. I actually talked to a, a lady yesterday. She's like, yep bought this with, and she showed me her pictures, it's oceanfront, bought this with my stock. Woo. So when you join uh, um, and you do your first transaction, you're gonna get some stock. When you cap, you get some stock. If you, uh, when you bring someone on and they do their first transaction, you get some stock. Now, anything that EXP gives you, like as a gift or as an award, um, then you have a three-year vesting period, meaning you gotta wait three years before you can cash it out. So I think that's fair. It's a great savings plan. People use this for retirement. People use this to buy beach houses. People use this to pay for college. Uh, that was part of my vision after my numbers hit high this year. Like we went from, I started at $7 a stock. And I believe this year we went all the way up to 190. Is that right, Barry? You, 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 190. So, um, so just think about that. If you had 100 shares at $7 and then they popped up to 190 a share, you're making bank. Now the icon agent, woo, I'll show my award just because I don't ever get to show it in the pretty. So you actually do get an award, um, which I didn't do it. I didn't do it for the reward. I did it for, uh, cause I love helping people. But once you hit icon, again, icon is when you capped and then you've done 20 more transaction or a certain dollar amount. Um, cause some people like in California, you're selling million dollar homes. You don't have to do 20 transactions for that. Uh, there's a, there's a number for that. Apologize. I don't know, but, um, you get to be what's called icon. And so I have paid $16,000 already this year to EXP because I've capped already this year. When I icon, I'm going to get $16,000 back in stock. Right. So what that means is kids college, like we said, savings, um, beach house, pay off bills, whatever it is you want to utilize it for, you've got an extra 16 grand. Again, another three year vesting period, but the bonus in it is, um, again, that's a savings plan to use it. So uh, I'm pretty excited. I've never had, I've never been good technically with money and EXP is helping me be good with money. <laughs> They're helping me figure out what to do with it. All right, so the agent equity program is a no brainer. It's absolutely beautiful. What that is, is every transaction you do and you can choose to do it, you don't have to, but we are a publicly owned stack. We are on NASDAQ, we got to ring the bell. Bing, bing, bing. People watch us, we made a bunch of like Forbes and all the stock people, again, I'm not a stock person, but uh, all the all the money people talked about EXP this year. Glenn uh, Sanford, our, our founder, was on EXP ringing the bell or on um, the floor ringing the bell. So um, the agent equity program, you get to buy stock at a discount. So like today, let's say I close a house. I can put 5% uh, of every transaction. I get to buy at a 10% discount. So I could buy it today at 10% and I could sell it tomorrow and I've made a 10% profit. Woo. <laughs> um, not recommended because you want to, you know, let that stuff simmer a little bit, but it's a beautiful deal. And again, um, that, that is a great savings plan. And that is how we bought our, um, we bought a flip this year. That's how we bought it is I had put in 5% of, uh, of my commissions into stock and we cashed it out when it went high and we bought a, we bought a flip. Now we're going to make some more money on, I'll put it back in the stock. So, uh, that's some great, and we're shareholders. So I, I didn't mention that meaning we own the company. So if you do good, I do good um, and vice versa. If I do good, you do good. So I will say, we didn't talk about that a lot, but I will say um, the culture here is like no other. My first day, um, I, I went, so we actually have an office uh, that we go to a brick and mortar. We have an office that we utilize with, with my group. And I popped into that office the first few days of my 
time with EXP. And David Upchurch is uh, a pretty well-known name here, big producer, he has a team. He came over from KW and kind of shocked the world. He sat down for an hour and a half with me. I'm not, his, I'm not in his line. I have nothing to do with him at all. He sat down for an hour and a half with me and poured into me and taught me more in that hour and a half than I think I had learned in six months at KW. And then Keeley and Rich, uh, they're, they're, they are my upline. They've spent just tantamount numbers. Is that the word, tantamount? Tantamount, that's a great word. Um, tantamount, I'm gonna go with uh, time with me, uh, helping me grow, pushing me out of my comfort zone, encouraging me, supporting me, sending me love gifts, uh, sending me happy text, and, and then also cracking down on me. What the heck are you doing? You got to work. So we have a beautiful uh, a support network here that um, is, is truly unlike any other. Like I, I cheer on the Kia up in uh, Baltimore. It doesn't matter to me if she succeeds. Like if I'm not getting anything from it, except for that I love her and I think she's cool and I want her to be successful in her life. So um, it's a beautiful thing to be uh, in COVID and having met so many people via um, uh, the world and via um, just the internet. It's a beautiful thing. So um, it's a beautiful day. Woo. All right, last part of our scene today. How are we doing on time? Are we crushing? Oh, we're crushing this. Woo. All right, so revenue share. Now I'll be straight up honest. This is a reason I came over. Um, but it's not the only reason. The reason I came over was I heard about this and I thought, well, this is a no brainer. I was doing this over at KW, bringing people over. And, and the most I ever got was um, under a thousand dollars on a, a check. And I will say the last three months, I have exceeded that every month. Um, and that's penance compared to what some people are doing with revenue share. Now, what revenue share is, I, I had personally no interest in a team. Like I tried doing the team deal, I sucked at it. Uh, it's just not my strength. <laughs> I'm good solo and then I'm good helping other people in sharing. So what this is, is this is a way you can bring people on, you can support them, you can uh, encourage them, you can bring you can bring them on in Kansas, in London, wherever you want, and you can be part of their network where you are supporting one another. I like to look at it as you're building your own referral network that is Robin Man based or that is Donna Cooper based. Um, I just saw your face there, Donna Cooper. Um, so you're building a network that is your referral network. So you could literally find an agent in every city and every country across the world and bring them onto your team. Team. So level ones, um, you need to bring on, so the first level one, zero to four, um, you're gonna get three and a half percent up to $2,800. Now this, let me say this first, this is not something you have to do at all. This is a choice, okay? Um, if you're not interested in this, hang around for question and answers, go to the bathroom real quick. And if you're not interested in this, this is totally cool. But to me, this is a no brainer. Like people are going to come with you because they like you. So, um, the bonus in the EXP model is that you are going to benefit and they are going to benefit. So, um, level ones, meaning I bring one person over, um, I'm going to get three and a half percent up to $2,800 off of those first four people. Now, those four people, they bring somebody on. Any of those people bring somebody on, they're going to be what's called a level two. Um, and I'm going to get 4% up to $3,200. So the more you build, and if my level twos bring on people, then you get level threes, level fours, all the way down. There are people that have stopped uh, doing real estate. They don't want to do real estate anymore. They love revenue share. And it's a beautiful thing. If you like supporting people, encouraging people, coaching people, helping people, um, believing in people, then this might be right up your alley. You can make serious money. You can help significant amounts of people. Um, the residual income for filling out level one and level two is about $36,000 uh, if you do this correctly, if you do this in this manner. So people, you can go all the way up to seven levels. I think there's not a, I think there's only a handful of folks that are, um, that are at that level, but it's, um, as I said earlier, I don't like a team. I love this. We are helping each other. Like my downline, they get my open houses. My downline, they get my information. We share information. We share each other's struggles. We share each other's joys. We have a listing. We help each other. Um, and you can do that everywhere. 
just because you you bring someone over uh, that's in England, you can still promote their stuff. Somebody here might want to buy a house in England. <laughs> so um, it's a beautiful, beautiful concept. And it is a significant way for you to um, have residual income. It's like passive. They tell you about doing uh, streams of income. We have three here, real estate, stocks, revenue share. So um, how, how's that, Barry? Did I, do I need to delve into any of that any deeper? No, perfect. I think I think what EXP ultimately is, Robin, just by everything you so eloquently said, is an opportunity. You know, I know what you know. In the UK, it's a very different story. You pay recruiters, and you know, most people in the UK are salaried employees, so right. you're not an independent contractor like we are here. Yet, being in this industry for long enough now, I think our mindset is almost as a salaried employee. You know, because we have to partner and hang our license with a company and you sell, you sell, you sell, you sell, you go to the team meetings every week, you, um, you know, you go to the events, but you're also competition within your own franchise, within your own office, which is great. I'm, listen, I'm all about competition. Every month as part of the influencers group, I see where I am in a quote league table and I love it, but not for everybody, you know, and we're all doing this together. But I think that's where the ownership piece comes in, Robin, right? Revenue share is an opportunity, which, I mean, realistically, not even... 97% of the company are looking at because we are all licensed real estate agents. Everyone on this call, I'm assuming, is the same or soon to be. So I think what EXP is, it, it removes a lot of limitations of, well, okay, I'm an agent with this company. This is what I can and this is what I can't do. And it gives us an opportunity to be more. You know, I don't need to have my brick and mortar office. But like you say, Robin, if you have one, you can have it. It's your choice. It's your prerogative. It's not a, hey, you know, this is what you can do. This is what you can't do. You know, you're part of a team. You're part of a revenue share organization. You may not want to be a buyer agent. You may want to be you and you may want to have your own autonomy. And that's what this model allows. And I think that's so important. And one thing I just wanted to add, um, you're saying about the 80-20 commission split. One thing we have here at EXP as of the last two years, any brand new agent, thank you, Robin, any brand new agent actually comes in and receives a mentor. Now, I'm a certified mentor here locally. So those, uh, that commission split does change for your first three deals. As opposed to an 80-20 split, it does go down to a 60-40. 10% goes towards this incredible learning curriculum that you get access to from the mentor program. And 10% also goes to the certified mentor, by which many people on this call could probably become a certified mentor like we are. Um, so it is different. That's for your first three deals. And quite frankly, what does the NAR say? Is it like 82% of people or it's well over 75% of agents get out of the industry within the first 18 to 24 months, which is crazy, but it's such a saturated industry. Everybody knows 10, 15, 20 real estate agents. What is it going to take for you to get the confidence to know that it is about you and your personal brand? EXP recommends and strongly heavily incentivizes you to have your own personal brand and to make you, your name, your face, your logo, the biggest thing on the sign. And that's what their mentorship program does. You know, the first three deals can really, I want to say make or break your career, career that is a bit drastic but it'll certainly set you on your path one way or the other so you get your mentor you can go on listing appointments you can go on buyer presentations you have that one-on-one -on -one experience with um not only your mentor but also your sponsor and their team as well so it's such a great thing i did just want to say because we are fully transparent that a brand new agent for your first three deals it does go down to a 60 40 split you know and robin you, you can tell me if i'm crazy i know i'm crazy but in my opinion, you know, you could be part of a real estate company or team and get a 50-50 split. For me, it's not always about the split. It's about the value you get within that split. You know, if you're getting value for 50%, great. I will bet you money, if you look into the mentorship program here at EXP, that extra 20% that would come off from your 80-20, you will see massive value in that. And certainly people that I've partnered with, and you've seen Robin and, and partnered with, and people around the company who have gone through that mentor program, and EXP was their first company, which... To a large extent, I wish it was mine. I've seen the benefit and value of that. But um, no, I mean, thank you to everybody. I did. I forgot. I forgot two things. I forgot two things. You got me? Um, two things I forgot just to circle back on. Oh, in the world. We didn't talk. We have over 50 hours of training a week in the world. Um, and also we have a fast track series for new agents that along with the um, the mentor program, a lot of people are like, oh, EXP is for veteran agents. Well, yeah, we're also for new agents. Our, I believe our fast track series is 
unbelievable. It literally walks you through the nuts and bolts of how to do real estate. So even if you're a, a new agent, I mean, a, a veteran agent to, um, but new to EXP, I recommend you go through the fast track series because it'll just re-hone your skills. It's a beautiful thing. And then the cool thing about our education classes that are live, we have over, I think it's over 50 hours of live classes a week. We also have a library of classes, but the live classes, um, actually all the classes, they are taught by icon agents. And you may have said that, uh, I think you did, but just, I wanted to reiterate that. That was one of the big things to me that spoke to me about EXP is that um, we're not taught by the, the like we had this wonderful old guy at, our, at my last office. He might've sold like six homes a year and I loved him, beautiful. He had done, he had done bold like eight times, but he still only sold like eight homes a year. He was teaching classes and God bless his soul. I mean, I, that's great if you want to do eight deals a year, but I don't, I want to do, 80. <laughs> so I want to learn from somebody who's doing 80. And that's what the, um, all the classes, you have to be an icon agent in order to teach and we're teaching in our expertise. So um, to me, that's phenomenal value. So I, you may have touched on that and, you know, things are a blur a little bit, but I just think that's a significant thing that, uh, that we provide. We provide great value, great education, great culture. Uh, and yeah, I'm happy. To, I'm happy to be here. I'm happy you're here. I'm glad I got to hang out with you today. Oh, I'm honored, Robert. And, 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 you know, I thank you for, for the amount of homes you sell. You know, if you see value in a company like this, there's something to be said for doing more research. You know, EXP is not for every agent. I don't believe every company is for every agent. Quite frankly, I don't believe real estate is for every agent either. But, um, <laughs> but thank you very much. Any questions, any thoughts? Thank you, Amy. Uh, Amy is a prime example with um, the VP of growth here on the eastern side of the wonderful US of A. So thank you. On average, 75 classes per week. That is absolute insanity. You know, I found my sweet spot as an agent is video. Um, I have this fancy elaborate background and stuff now, but I'm just someone who, not when I started it two and a half years ago, but is very confident on video. I can get my point across. And I think authenticity is what sells in our industry. So, you know, I will teach people on video when I'm an icon agent. Uh, I don't want to learn from someone who's just, you know, turn their phone around for the first time and press record. I, I think who you, what you feed in, you put out, and I think that's nothing more appropriate than that in our industry. So those 75 classes a week are taught by the best of the largest independent real estate um, brokerage in America, which is tremendous. If you have any questions, good, bad, indifferent, you can um, unmute your microphone, which I can't see here, but should be in the bottom left-hand corner, and feel free to fire away or use the chat box. I will ask Robin to stare awkwardly at the screen uh, for the next 20 seconds or so, but feel free to fire away. Regardless, we appreciate your time. We really do. So thank you. Um, well, let me look through the questions here. I'm going to, uh, people can unmike, but also uh, I'm going to look through here. They want to know where you're from uh, originally, Barry. No, where are you located? Um, I'm in Mexico City, Mexico. No, I answered <laughs> that. I'm in Davidson. Robin, where are you exactly? I'm in Waxhaw, which is uh, just south of Charlotte. Waxhaw, North Carolina. Any other questions, everybody? I see you're using the chat box, so thank you. And again, um, you know, this will be recorded. We do this every week. Fortunately, not Robin and I, you get bored. As you say, Robin, you're very kind. My wife would say you get bored of my accent very, very quickly. So we'll be back <laughs> next week uh, with, I think, Rich Tomasini, Mr. Thomas Hocker. Every week, same link, same time, same day. Someone will be explaining this. In the meantime, whoever invited you to the call, I'll get your question in a second, Tina. Uh, whoever invited you to the call, it's going to be a great resource. They honestly want your honest feedback and thoughts, and um, they are always a good person of resource to go to. Uh, thank you, Sandra. You're very kind. Is the mentor program just 6040, or are there other fees to join? New agent here. Tina, you're getting into the best industry in the world. My commiserations and congratulations at the same time. Um, 6040, no, everything there. And again, whoever got uh, asked you on this call, they can send you the recorded. We have all these more company-based slides, which have that screen, which has all the fees, the splits, the commissions. As a brand new agent, you are gonna to have to sign up for various things, your MLS, showing time, Board of Association of Realtors, all that stuff, the mumbo jumbo. But here at EXP, it is as simple as that. $149 startup fee, the monthly fee remains the same as $75. It's a 60-40 split for your first three deals. Uh, nothing hidden. That is, uh, that is quite frankly, all the, the numbers. Great question and thank you. Thank you, Sandra. Thank you, Lance. Any other, any other questions? Or, young lady, we're within an hour. So we'll, we'll wait another minute. And um, any questions, you can feel free to fire away.
actually a free tidbit while thank you tina um robin in your opinion in your real estate opinion what is the number one thing or the number one piece of advice you can give an agent to be successful be it brand new be it veteran what's the one piece of advice you would give lead gen every day get uncomfortable oh nikili said get uncomfortable yeah I, I say lead you in every day, 20 people a day. It can be a text. It can be a message. It can be a Facebook post. It can be a call. It can be an email. Uh, it can be a text. It can be a Twitter, whatever. Uh, 20 people a day. What about that. you? What about you? Um, for me, it's be you. You have to sell yourself. And I think it's, it, it's shameless in part, but I think people that don't understand that it's about you. Again, I could be Barry Corbett with EXP, which I am, but I've created this logo, this brand, and when I get to the listing table, people ask me who EXP are. And EXP is who has given me the leverage to create my brand. EXP is also the company that's given me the confidence and um, the, the tools to grow it. But the home seller as a listing agent only really cares about you. So that uncomfortable factor and comment, I think, comes in. But I think you've got to understand that this industry to really succeed is about us. We leverage with a great company like EXP and our partners and all the tools. But I think we have to understand much like I said earlier on, right? That our success is about us and our failures because of us. Stop taking excuses and look in the mirror. Ooh, that was a little harsh, but I think you get the gist <laughs> of what I'm saying. Um, I love this industry. I love this company. And I love the fact that all of you are on this call. Robin, thank you. I wanted to put you on the spot. I always think there's something of value, whether EXP is for someone or not. I think someone that's of your super high success level, I think that comment will go a long way with people. So we will call it a morning. Thank you, everybody, and we hope to see you again soon. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Barry. You did amazing. Great job. Yes, you did. Great job. Thanks, everybody. Thank you, Woo-hoo. Woo-hoo.